right now, people. So Cassie has really opened the doors and gave other women the courage to come out and speak about their abuse as well. And it's seeming like Kanye West, not only Kanye West is getting sued in a new lawsuit, people. The Dream. If y'all remember The Dream, all right, his ass is also getting sued. Let's start off with Kanye. Now, Kanye says, of course, his assistant actively pursued him actually. You see what I'm saying? Of course, he's going to say, I didn't do that. All right? I don't know if he did or not. All right? Kanye was sued for actual assault harassment by ex-assistant. She is suing him for a breach of con uh, contract, actual harassment, wrongful termination. Gender discrimination, uh, fraud, and other employment law violations. Now, see, she, these are shit that's in your handbook. You know what I'm saying? See, once you start bringing out those words in that damn handbook type shit for work and environment, people, it's serious, man. And, you know, that's where the lawyer come in there. But, uh, cause she's not only doing that, she's saying, and, and for other employment law violations, his ass has got to pay up some money, people. Now, she is claiming after a year of working for Kanye, she promoted, she was promoted to chief of staff, then she was fired, all right? This is according to Billboard, um, she was offered a $3 million, uh, severance pay that was never paid. Now, Kanye offered her a $1 million salary while employed to him, then a year later offered her another million dollars, which the lawsuit claims he did not pay to delete her OnlyFans. He was paying her that to delete her OnlyFans account. Kanye says she needs to be more godlike, which she agreed. All right? So she was going, she wanted that money. She said, forget that OnlyFans then, right? Yeah, so Kanye sent her actual photos, allegedly, and videos of him having ex with other women, and he allegedly masturbated uh, over the phone with her or something of that nature, people. Disgusting. <laughs> Disgusting, people. Kanye West. Kanye West is, is doing weird things. Now, we all know it shouldn't shock nobody that Kanye West is strange, but what I find even stranger is that that ex-assistant reminds me of Kim Kardashian. Yeah, she, she looks like her. All right? Let's keep going. Now, the dream accused of grape, <laughs> physical abuse, manipulation in new lawsuit, people. Uh, the victim is saying she was trafficked, allegedly, under the recording and distribution contract into an abusive, violent, and manipulative Relationship, the words, the words, the, the choice of words, people, makes a difference. Now, their relationship allegedly was filled with physical assaults, violent actual encounters, all right? Now, he made her think she was going to be a star by manipulating her with false promises. You know, sweet nothings, people, sweet nothings. The dream frequently strangled her during violent X. Okay, sometimes with hands. Now, when I first read it, I said sometimes with hands. Well, what else he use other than his damn hands? Okay, so other than hands, people, other than hands, once using the collar of her dress. Uh on multiple occasions, Dream choked Miss Mangrove. That's her that's her name. He choked her so intensely that she almost lost consciousness. Damn. Alright? Now she says her silence has become too painful. And realized that she needs to tell her story to heal. Okay. She hopes that doing so will also help others and prevent future horrific abuse. Now, the dream, the dream released a statement saying these allegations are not true. He is 
he is against all harassment. Now, I, I remember when, I think, uh, him and Christine, Christina Milian, I know they have a baby. I don't remember if they got married or anything, but I remember when they were dating or whatnot. And she also, in the past, has said that she described her relationship to the dream as a nightmare. So people are insinuating, they bring that back up, and they're saying, hey, he used to whoop the whoop on her, too. You know, whoop whop the bam on her, flip flop. Man, come on, man. Now, it's, it's you know, because I always thought that the dream was a little zesty back in the day. And I loved his songs, you know what I'm saying? I loved his songs. But he always seemed a little zesty. It, I don't know if it was them lips or or them, them wide neck tank tops he used to wear, you know what I'm saying, uh, showing too much, too much sexy, you know, and I feel like when women, and I could be wrong, but I feel like when, when men beat on women like that, so, uh, weird, like, uh, I feel like they really hate women. And it could be to the certain extent of they hate that they hate they hate that they love men you know the men that are some men that are doing these things they hate that they love men for real you see what i'm saying so they get a woman and they do a super dirty because they mad they might even want to be a woman you see what i'm saying deep down inside you feel me uh, I watched a movie long time ago in conclusion to this video. All of this shit right here is crazy and ridiculous, so they need to get this resolved. Um, but in conclusion to this video, I seen a movie one time. I don't remember what it was. See you in paradise, right? Um, and it was a man that was married to this lady. And every night, damn near, he would come home. She'd be sleeping in the bed, and he would beat the shit out of her. And he'd be crying, and, she would, and then she was so stupid. He, she would hold him, and, and she didn't know what the hell was wrong with him and stuff. And she, you know what I'm saying, hold him after he didn't beat your ass. Now, he he beat her so much, and then he crying. He having a nerve, he having a mental breakdown and shit. And you know why he was doing that? Because he just left from having SEX with a guy. But he liked doing that, right? But he has to mask that he's not really into guys by being with a woman. And that could be being with her for years or getting married to her, whatever. He has to do that or sleeping with multiple women just to prove that what? You are not G-A-Y. Ain't that insane? That's some insane ass shit, people. Just be true to your motherfucking self. You know what I'm saying? You don't have to take out on other people your damn problems, because you, you like guys, but then like guys on the low end, but that ain't cool, but I'm just saying, if you're going to like guys on the low, keep it, you just with guys, don't go back to women, you see what I'm saying, type shit, people, what do you guys think about this, huh? that's what I think, I think some guys hate women, and they really love men, you see, <laughs> not all of them, but I'm saying, Shouldn't no man be putting their hands on a damn woman. Now, it had, I seen somewhere where somebody was, uh, shout out to no, Nosy Hoes, because she had played a video of a woman actually reading the whole lawsuit of the dream. And he was doing some Ike and Tina Turner shit. You know what I'm saying? And he had went in the booth with the young lady, because this young lady's supposed to be like his protege. And he went in the booth and roughly raped her, where it ended up she was bleeding out her JJ people. What the fuck? This is a lawsuit, allegedly. Damn. Huh? People, what do you guys think about this? All this abuse and shit that's been going on in the industry, y'all need to cut that shit out, man. And see, when that lady say, oh, I felt like I was being trafficked. See, that's that pimping and that's that pimping shit. See, they changed pimping to trafficking. You can't be a pimp anymore, people. Or a pimptress. You see what I'm saying? That shit is trafficking. 
You are trafficking human bodies. X trafficking. All right, people. So anyway, that's an update on Kanye and the dream. You know what I'm saying? You know, all this stuff come out later. Like the dream, his stuff had came out years and years ago, but not to this extent where somebody's suing him and stuff like that. So in the word, the, see, I pay attention to the choice of words. And when you have an employee that you have a person that's employed by you, and they start saying words that's in that handbook, especially about sexual harassment, and they are saying this is in the handbook and this is what had happened. You know, all the definitions to that harassment stuff. And, you know, she has a long-ass list, Dream. She has a long-ass list, man. Damn. So, I don't know. I, I tell you one damn thing. If she can prove all that and whatnot like that, they'll same thing with Kanye West, man. You already know what's going to happen. They're going to have to give up that money. All right? Message.